So here's Monica with her 4-6 manifester design and Vincent with his 2-4 manifesting generator. So we know that there's a difference there. The single definition, 9 and 0, nowhere to go. Six electromagnetic channels. If you recall, this was a relationship that lasted, I don't know, maybe 15 years or something like that. And then they split. Electromagnetic channels with the channel of awakening, a design of a commitment to higher principles, also the channel of exploration, following one's own convictions, the channel of curiosity, seeker, searcher, channel of acceptance, organizational being, channel of money, materialists together, and the channel of abstraction, design of mental activity mixed with clarity. So we see there are six new thematics that this relationship is to this partnership. Six new dynamics of like and dislike or attraction or repulsion. So the electromagnetic makes sparkiness, but it's not the thing that's going to make your relationship work. This is the thing to get out of your head if you ever took on that misconception because of Facebook land. This is not what makes your relationship work electromagnetic, okay? It's interesting and often a valuable thing that's in a relationship because despite the one side where one is tired of it and doesn't want it, it's still in terms of your genes. Remember, he's only talking about genes. It's still something very, very rewarding because it gives you precisely what the genes want you to get. And so what does it do? It sticks you into relationship with this partner. I can remember being in relationship with my husband. You know, we were together off and on for a really long time, living around or near each other. I could not move away every time he dumped me. And it was multiple times. I kept hanging around and confused as to why I was still hanging around waiting for him, you know, hoping, wishing, praying that he would come back and give me another chance. And then I saw my love gates unconscious are turned on by his connection with me. The genes want what is different. This is what sticks us, connects us and sticks us in relationship, but it's not the thing that's going to make it work. We have to look elsewhere for that. Okay. It is a challenge. So a conundrum, it could be also, if you will, depending on the dynamics of what is connecting up with the other in this partnership. Here's the sparkiness, the places of potential challenge or upset. Now they can bring beautiful things. They can be dynamic. Uh, here, let's do a little bit of keynoting here with love gates. So I'm going to grab a pen. She is blue and he's green. So why does Monica love him? Well, with him, I feel as if I can follow my own convictions. I'm empowered to follow my own convictions. Vincent, with you, I feel as if I'm awakened to my higher self. Do you see that? Vincent, with you, I feel as if I have my power partner, <laughs> the person who's I've met my match potentially, potentially. Vincent, with you, we can be curious and we can be, you know, making sense of things together. With you, my ideas might come into fruition and I can share what I'm really, you know, pondering and believing about what happened in the past, the meaning, the reason, the sense making behind why life is so painful and futile. Vincent, with you, I feel as if I found someone I can share answers with so that together the process of acceptance of patterns and finding the facts to back up my opinions, it's just more engaging, enlightening, enlivening with you. Now, I am just anthropomorphizing very general. I would go way more specific if I was looking at the line values and the planets, the life aspects, the themes. You know how to do that because you've already gone through a year of training. All right. So what is a hanging gate? Hanging gate is either a receptor to being conditioned by the other in a dormant potential, 
or it's active and it's on and it's still receptive on the other side of the channel to being conditioned by the other. So every time you look at your design, look at those hanging gates everywhere in your design, because those hanging gates are invitations from life to be conditioned by others. And the moment you have hanging gates at either end that that each person is carrying, all of a sudden they meet each other in that channel. There's this fundamental dynamic at work. The glow happens. <gasps> you complete me. This is it. Now, that has nothing to do with whether or not that thing really is it, can be it, or ever could be it. It's just the genes going, wow, terrific. Here we go. Opposite. opposite. The attraction. The attraction is there. Let's investigate. Let's check this out. Let's play with this. So it's not necessarily the end-all, be-all. It isn't. Won't be able to 